too much auto tune on, on the Marseille. Too much, too much. But after I've listened, uh, I was listening to some of the tracks. After you said uh, the mixtape is hot. Yeah? They were trying to bring new sun in the next music. Yeah, and then I listened to the new uh, mixtape, some couple of tracks. But there was less. Okay. And then the track, I'm mean, honestly speaking, I like the new mixtape. Thank you. There's more work that has been done. Now, Jay have done a good job this time. Better it's a peace. It's a win for my friends. Yeah, it's a win. And then let me ask you this. What do you think when you compare the previous Nizo? Eh? Yes. And then <laughs> you put in the they put it on yeah. uh, they just like put it on something. Uh yeah. what do you think when you compare him before and now? The one that Nisa has as as the Nisa before he was the honest friend. Uh, the honest friend. Okay, Nisa first started uh, his music with beautiful message that has a lot of hearts and family mm-hmm. and had a lot of target market considering all the age and youngsters. Yeah. So he was spreading the love and putting hope in people's hearts and lives. Yeah. So, considering the change that he dropped out, the extreme over, which came last year, and considering his sound, as the question was, um, is his first album going to change, is his sound going to change, is music going to change, as everybody was wondering. And considering the to him, uh, singing all about uh, smoking weed, just the ladies, beautiful people, selling uh, money, and... You know, yeah, just putting women in the naked eye. Uh, I believe his mindset has changed. And I believe his friends and generous business uh, can listen to his lyrics and understand what he's talking about now. So most of his music doesn't accommodate the first target that he had at first. Uh, he's targeting youngsters, um, crackheads, um, or funky party troopers. Yeah. So... Saying it like that, it shows that when his music changes, his music changes, his target market changes, and when his target market changes, it means it's a different game, it's a new level that people have to adjust to his music. So, himself. so, even when you tell me now, I'm starting to see more already, you know what? He's, he's, he's being himself. He's not talking about all these other crazy stuff. He's trying to bring out that him, that the real him, that person that we, some people that grow up with him, they know him. Than uh, what he does when he do the mistakes and all this. Yeah, I feel it's just the part of him growing up and adapting to things and his new lifestyle. So we just have to continue to support him, you know. And he was crowned last year famous uh, king of hip hop, but mostly this is a different story. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I know. You know what? I'm seeing more when you're saying that because there is when you when you look on the on, on his side now, uh, it's more relaxed. And then we need to deliver on the lyrics. It's not like the way he used to do. You know? I think he's trying to to, to accommodate uh, people that are open-minded than just listening to the lyrics. Uh, and then you catch two lines and you think like, wow, I know he a song. But you have to give good music to your people. People look by the music. People look about you. People look up to your show. Yeah, people come to the show, but again, you need to listen that people grow. Remember that when I listened to music back then, the buy and all that, and then now, it's oh. different. It's like, it's totally different from the time, the first time I spoke to him back in the day, and now, it's totally different. It's like, I've grown, and there needs more music that really makes sense. Something that will say, hey, you're going wrong, why don't you take this road? I thought music will find the right players and I believe then the listeners will love what you are talking about music and what they think and what they always want you to know. So coming to the fashion trend, being paid, coming to Limbombo and everybody looks all set up with all the glasses on, you know, turning it into a small jewelry. What do you think about that? Uh, turning into a small jewelry to me into a small Miami, like... I think the way Limbobo is growing, man, besides the entertainment and all this, uh, that is wonderful. It's growing very fast, and then if we're going to create our own entertainment and have fun at home, 
uh, similar to what they do in Devon. I'm telling you, yeah. it's gonna be great. So uh, our film industry is growing extremely huge. Yeah, it's growing. The only thing that we need to introduce, people need to understand, because they find other, you know, they they say funny thing that I'm always laughing about. Uh, uh, I can put a trade out uh, for 25 megabytes to download for free, eh? Yeah. And then you take your own trade to download that trade. And you uh, pull out the trade. And then you take the trade you still ready to download by SMS. Mm-hmm. You complain. What do you think about that? Because we can proceed it no more means we have to download this money pay from on DIS. Yeah, but there, there is a difference, you see. I understand there's a difference of BIS and money, but if they don't support uh, the artist, what's going to happen? Artists are gonna, gonna, gonna get tired. So some people remember they don't have studios, they need to pay, and then pay like 120 per hour to record. Wow, something else. You have to use money to make money. That's the thing. That's why we always have to all these pushing so, 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 so hard. Yeah, it was Nema. Oma Ongun with Rita D, we are about to sign out on the Van Rep radio station. So you know what? We're going to leave you with a track by Miz of Feel. Put it on. It is from uh, the, the, the latest single that is going to be coming out on his album. Uh, the second name of the album will be Reality Check. What do you think about this? It's not the second name of the album, Manavi. Let me correct that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Single out. Okay. Let's put it on. Let's put it on. And then the from the reality check. Probably he's checking it on reality. Oh now we'll find out from the music people checking up at Richard Diva, the only diva in detail, Van Brett, Van Brett. Yeah, we'll be checking out the latest trends, second trends, the latest trips. Uh, what you wanna know about the old thing for for music industry going big, film industry. So me, Nema, Van Brett, we won. Who yeah. should be Richard D entertainment? Yeah, I'm the most bloody. <laughs> okay, okay, we'll talk very soon. Let me, let me bounce. Yeah. Put on, put on, put on. The haters don't know. Yeah, but-
Manapo Araba Busaba Kokaba Blenchen Roto Naba Nichi Bona Sine Raba Borro Wera Lupa Mara Asingore Lupa Kumbo Lutra Weta No Matumbo Kore Lupa Kopanda Yopanda Matio Tamba Kose Lupa Siwano Pipa Manda Kosi Bona